What's our stats? That was poopy. Bum, bum. All right, let's see how this goes. So we got this here. For notifications. The meet your maker at an update, that's good. We go here, we go here. Hey, Suicide Run, what's up, man? Hope you are doing well. And the bot is working, nice. I forgot to test the bot before stream, but it's fine. It's fine. Let's see if it's still broken or not. Got the PS5 up and running? Nice. How are you liking it? Big uh, difference, isn't it?
I know there was a video. Yeah. Every single time I started it, start it, I let the trailer play just because I like to get into that little vibe feel. But every single chapter that releases a new killer, a new survivor, there's always a little primo video thingy. Uh, Tampa is two outs away from having 11 wins in a row. A Major League Baseball record, but not a overall record because in the National League, a team went 13 0 before they merged with Major League Baseball. So, two more games if Tampa wins the next two, and they'll have the all time professional baseball record for most wins in a row. Huggers on that. Nice. Everything seems fine. Glad to hear it. What was your first game to play? What is going to be your first game? Rainy Day Sales. Okay. Um, Hag Mud Medusa. Survivor, Survivor, don't care. 30% uh, Paradise Beatdown. Okay. Dawn might be fun. Deceiver. The Clown. Exuberant. I see what you did there. Lost mascot. Oh. Yeah, that'd be fun. That would actually be a good uh, one for you to play, since there's a lot of changes to it. Plus you get RTX, so you get to deal with the fun ray tracing and stuff. Hmm. Alright, so that's down to 1080. Not bad. 1485, a little bit more powerful, but still expensive. Which is funny because I spent I think full price on these. Yeah. That's fine. Stockholm art. Eh. Deceiver. Meh. Yeah, this one. I think we had the body. Yeah, we had the body. All right. So I'm missing his weapon. I don't care about the weapon. Um, the outfit might be cool since it's all jet black. That one is 400. Yeah, something like that looks pretty cool, actually. Hmm. Uh, characters. They said something about Legion. They're all 1080, the pink Frank one. Yeah, so pink bunny is on sale for 600. It's not bad. Probably not that bad at all, but we already have one of the bunnies. We got the blue bunny. Which is what I wanted. Whatever, yeah. Um, what was the other skin? Ag, I think, right? Mud Medusa or something like that. That's Crypto. Scorched Charvos. Mud Medusa. That looks sort of cool. Eh. I mean, if I'm going to do a hag skin, I would rather do something like this. Oh, it's got the pretty glowing effects. This one has no particles, which is a little weird. So yeah, probably something like this. Oops. So that does have red particles on the chest. It's just so subtle. Versus the blue. Okay. Eh. Meh. Uh, how much is Tricksters? That one's sort of cool. I like the bat. I'm not a fan of anything else. Yeah, it does. But really, at that point, you're not really using it to be stealthy, as you're just doing it to be a haha. -ha, you see me and I'm still gonna kill you kind of thing. It's more of a 
flashy kind of statements than a stealth thing. New world. Sort of colonial. All right. Very weird. I know it's all over mine, I think. Pig. Organic monstrosity from Blight is the only one we didn't see. Oh, and spirit. So Blight and spirit are the two I'm missing that I didn't see. Okay. I clicked the wrong button. Damn it, man. Light. Oh, spirit right there. Which one is it that's massively on discounts? Don't you all 10%? Attack on Titan, we already have. 10. That one's sort of cute. In an eerie way. That would be the one I would get down the road. The little beachwear kind of thing. Looks sort of cool. Oh, it's this one. Eh. Not my thing. Oh, that's sort of cool though. Which killers come with the base game? It depends on what version of the game you get, because there's like four or five different variations of the base game you could get. Uh, none of them are going to be licensed killers, but we go ahead and get rid of that. Ten percent, ten percent, ten ten, ten ten, tens, thirty. There it is. Eh. Meh. I was secretly hoping for this one. This one would have been on sale. I probably would have jumped on it. Maybe this one, because this one does look pretty cool too. Either one of those two, I probably would have jumped on. But whatever. So this is how the killer roster is lined out. So the top row is all free. This comes with every version of the base game no matter what. You're guaranteed every single one of these killers. Second row, you're guaranteed Huntress, you're guaranteed Hag, and you're guaranteed Doctor. The shape is one that you have to buy. Cannibal is one you have to buy. Nightmare is one you have to buy. Pig you have to buy. Clown I think comes free. After that, it gets a little murky because it comes down to what version of the game you get. Uh, for the most part, they'll tell you which one you do and don't get. Well, let's see what the current version is. A lot of older versions have different special bundles. Dead by... Oh, no. Wait. I imagine you probably played on PlayStation, right? So let's look at what the PlayStation bundle has. At the moment, it's 29 bucks. However, it is included for free if you have PlayStation Plus Extra. However, the free version of PlayStation Plus Extra is in yours to keep. It's just more or less you get to play it as long as you have a subscription. If the subscription subsides, then you get access to it again after you resubscribe. Um, So the basic edition that you get comes with seven killers and seven killers only. That's the Trapper, the Hillbilly, the Wraith, the Nurse, the Hag, the Huntress, and the Doctor. So that is all you get. And that is the absolute basic edition of Dead by Daylight. Survivor-wise, you get Meg, Claudette, Jake, Dwight, Ace, Nia, Fang, David, and one uh, premium character, which is Bill Overbeck. 
And Tampa right. won 11 games in a row. Puggers. Yep. So you'll get those seven. So if we look at it on the charts, you get the whole first row. You get Huntress. And you get Doctor. So the only ones you don't get is this and the bottom row. So these seven you get. It's everything except for Michael Myers and the third row you get as a killer for a base game. Mm. Which, not too bad. You can do a lot with that to start with. But that's one of those things to where if you like it, you can spend the cash to buy the base game. And then just buy the little DLCs as they pop up. They're not horrendously expensive. Um, as you can see, they're not too bad. Seven bucks gives you one killer. If you want Trickster, that's seven bucks. Uh, Nightmare on Elm Street is seven. Ash is eight or five. Your Excel is you can ignore. That's a charity case is just stuff from streamers. So when the game first came out, a bunch of streamers tossed in some cosmetics and this all goes to a charity, but you get special little skins for some of the original stuff. Like there's a O Tofu t-shirt for one of the survivors. Uh, Almsbreaker has a unique Huntress skin. Uh, Oni's eight bucks, eight bucks. Origin Fog is 8. Ghostface is 5. And sometimes you'll find these on sale too. So you can really pick and choose. Uh, you can get the Killer Pack. Which is 30 bucks. And this gives you pretty much everything down to Trickster that is Dead by Daylight unique. Meaning it's not a licensed killer. So if you were to get this pack you can have everything down to here as killers for free which means you won't get dredge you won't get artist knight or skull merchant but that also means you don't get the free killers or the uh license killers so you won't get myers you won't get freddy or cannibal or pig Ghostface. so you can't get those the only killer you cannot buy anymore is Demogorgon. And that's because the deal with Netflix expired. And Netflix didn't give the green light to renew it. So that would be the only killer you cannot get in this game. But everyone else you could still buy and get. You could theoretically get Demogorgon. But you're going to have to pay out the ass. Because there, there are still some codes of the Demogorgon version of the PlayStation that you get out there. Um, let's see. So these versions right here. So if you get lucky to find this version of the game, then you could have Demogorgon. But the catch to this, to make it work, is that you have to play the game with a disc in your console. But it would allow you to have Demogorgon in game. That is the only way currently to get Demogorgon on your Dead by Daylight game. If you were to have bought this back in September of last year, you could have had behavior give you a digital code and that digital code would make it so you no longer need to use a disc. Because if you remember, I have a digital PS5, not a disc P5. 
PS5. So the only way I could play Demogorgon was for them to give me a code to use it on my console. But after September of last year, they quit giving out codes. So now the only way you could play them is to buy this disc. And sadly, you're going to be paying out the ass for it. You're looking close to 100 bucks if you want to play Demogorgon. However, to be honest, you're better off waiting to see if uh, that killer makes a return to the game. Because there have been some ideas or mentions that we may get another Stranger Things chapter down the road. Which, if that's the case, then obviously Demogorgon would return and you want to be paying that enormous fee. Yeah. 90 bucks, 80, 109, 101, 129. If we were to sort this by buy now price. And then go those first. No game. 65 bucks is the cheapest you can get it right now. And it looks like the median is anywhere from 80 to 90. So, if you're hellbent on Demogorgon, that's pretty much what you're going to have to do. But you're not missing anything, really, in all honesty. If you want to play a Demogorgon-like killer, then you could easily go for something like Dredge. Because he has a similar teleporting around mechanic as a uh, Demo has. If you want something that's more monster-esque, then obviously you still have Dredge still too, but you also have... Um, where do you go? Yeah, Blight. That's more of a monster-esque kind of thing. Nemesis, obviously. But yeah. They're just pretty cool. You could get a little evil horse skin for him. But, and then of course he has a couple other unique ones like this one's his royal skin. He has a little Christmas skin which was pretty cool. Which I think this was what Jack Frost inspired. The horror movie Jack Frost I think. And then of course, Boris. And then of course you also have survivor games and stuff like that too. So on the survivor side, you'll be stuck with the top two rows. So everything to David is pretty much what you'll be getting for free. Oh wait, they said Fang, right? Yeah, they said Fang. So everything up to Fang. So you'll have Dwight, Meg, Claudette, Jake, Nia, William Beck, Overbeck, Overbeck, David King, Ace Visconti, and Fang. And then obviously Quentin, you're gonna have to buy. Detective Tap is from uh, IP. Kate, you're gonna have to buy from an IP, from an IP. Uh, the only two survivors you can get are these two. Nancy Wheeler and Steve Harrington. Because those two are tied to Stranger Things as well. But again, you're not missing anything. And of course, you have some iconic characters. You have Leon Kennedy. It's gonna be a tough road. Um Stay sharp. God only knows what's down here. It's a couple issues really when it comes to Survivor. One, I don't find a playstyle entertaining for myself. And like short burst, if I got like nothing better to do, I'll play it. But most of the time I prefer to play the killer. I'm on it. The other issue is that everyone loves playing Survivor. 
because it's a little bit more forgiving and it's a lot easier at certain times of day to get more games in than if you were to play killer. And the reason I say that is unlike killer, killer, you have to play the whole game no matter what. It doesn't matter if you're winning or losing. You're pretty much forced to play the whole game. That's actually driving me crazy. Can I fix that? I don't know. Uh, webcam grouping. Very soft and breaks. There we go. It was driving me crazy that it was all transparency. But, um, yeah. So, with Survivor, once you die, you can go ahead and go recoup your next game. Which means if you die in the first two minutes of the game, okay, go re -queue. You want to get into the next game. Maybe you could get one, two, three games done while the other killer is still in that one game. To where the killer, not really the case. So for people that stream this game, they prefer to play Survivor. One, faster games to get in and out. Two, they can play with friends or viewers, or other streamers. And to be brutally honest, comparing the two, it's a lot easier to play Survivor in stream than it is to play Killer in stream. Because if you're playing Survivor in streaming, you only have to listen for two things. You have to listen to a heartbeat, which tells you to run away, and you're listening for a scale check notification sound. That's it. That's all you gotta do. So you can just sit there on a generator and hit skill check, skill check, and just talk to the, you know, chat away, skill check, skill check, talk away to chat, skill check, skill check, skill check. It's, it's not that hard to do. They have a little crumble when you start throwing in other perks and add-ons and very aggressive killers, of course, but for the most part, there's nothing that requires you to use more than half a brain cell to really play Survivor. Now what gets dangerous is when you get survivors that are very good. When you get survivors that are great outside of the whole gen meta. So those that are willing to take a flashlight and use them at keen opportunities to get quick blinds or saves. Those that could loop for days on some of the tiles. Those that are pros at drawing attention from another survivor to themselves and then causing distractions or those that are great at sabotaging you know all these little side subjects kind of stuff that's where those kind of survivors really shine out and you have some very good survivors like skirms and occasionally tofu who do a great job at that but for the most part you're gonna have survivors who just sit there on a generator and they're just shit talking away with their friends and they had occasional little go check. I mean, that's about it. To where on the killer side of things, you're playing by yourself. Yes, I get to talk to you guys in chats, but most of my attention's on the game. I don't, by default, I can't see the aura of everyone else or get a rough idea of where everyone is. I don't have a status UI saying, hey, my friends are working on a gen because I'm playing by myself, right? To where the survivors, they get to see that. They get to see if a generator is being repaired on. They can see who's working on the totem. They can see who's healing. They can see who's doing nothing. You really can't do that with a killer without running perks and add-ons. So I have to split my mind and try to figure out what they're doing, where they're going. Are they on a gen? Are they on a totem? Are they trying to do this? Are they trying to do that? What are they doing? So I have to sort of treat like a chess game where I'm trying to think a few steps ahead to get around them. And then while I'm doing that, I'm listening for audio cues. Do I hear footsteps? Do I hear whimpering? Do I hear healing? Do I hear a generator being worked on? Do I hear a hook being sabotaged? So it's a little bit harder to do that and keep an eye on chat and do both that at the same time. So... But on the other side, it's the same thing if I want faster games in terms of queue times. 
So like right now, you see where it says bonus 100. That means there are more survivors and Q than killers. So for me to do stuff, it's easier for me to queue up as a killer because I don't have to wait too long. So with all those factors combined, I myself like to play killer more because one, it feels more like a challenge. Even if people say that it's a killer easy meta, eh, you need a greater disagree on some spots. But I find it to be a little bit more of a challenge because if I make a mistake, I eat it. So if you're a survivor and you make a mistake, well, you may be out of the game, but you still got three other friends to so help carry your carry the team to the end. I won't be as easy, but they can still probably do it. Um, but -da -bum 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 -bum. first game of the night, let's go Huntress. And because there is that one bug still in the game, we can't use Mori's, sadly. And that's also why we run all these aura perks. Because it just straight up makes it easy for me to see where people are. I don't have to spend that time trying to find them. I could just put them as pressure quickly. There was one other perk I was looking at last night. For love of me, I can't remember what it is. Huh. It wasn't darkness revealed, it was something else though. It had something to do with hooks. It wasn't pain resonance. It wasn't floods of rage. Thunk, 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 thunk. Probably gonna have to Google it to see what it is. It's very up, up there. It is. I must trick. That is what I was thinking of because you see the aura of any survivor within six meters of a hook. That is something we can make some use out of. But for now, let's try this. Hopefully we don't get a network error. And we don't, it's always a good sign when you don't get a network error. May have spoke too soon. This will be our first game of the night. Uh, I had the time talking, but that was good. It should be a little interesting to see how this will go. <laughs> Ooh, that's not going to be good. Can we crust? with what who we're playing. Eleven and over raids. Feels good to say. Do, 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 do. The one thing I will say is that uh, for you, it might take a little bit to get used to the controller. 
you're still gonna have to play around with your controller sensitivity to get to the place you want to be in this game. Some people like it extremely freaking loose, others like to have the stick a little tight. The other good thing now too is that uh, the way the game has changed over the years is that you can actually practice now in a custom lobby with bots. So you can really start fine tuning your stuff without having to stop in the middle of the game to figure it out. Nice, nice, nice. One gen done, that's fine. Feels bad. I got stuck in the rock. That dude didn't rage quit, he uh, lagged out. So there was a network issue still. Because he was running into a wall for a little bit. That's the only reason why I didn't know. Because when we ran by him, he was just stuck on a wall running. Which is a shame because they had a very good start. But that sort of swings things in our favor now. We could take our foot off the gas a little. That was weird. Went for a grab and stopped.
All right. Looks like they're gonna go for a medium vault at first, that's the only reason why I went for the swing. But it didn't pay off. Feels bad. Give it a little bit of time. We're gonna run into me and buy block me, can't get mad on that one. on what they're using and generally if they sabotage a hook what happens is the hook actually falls off the platform and that means you can't use it and it could be a cooldown of like 30 seconds or it could be three minutes it just depends on how it gets sabotaged if it's three minutes then well you're sort of fucked for a little bit
So where'd you bait her on that one? Let's see if we can find a Claudette. Claudette to be found. Jeez. Yeah, this one wasn't his fault at all. He just had a network issue, which sucks, but it is what it is. You switch the TV station for Thena. This is just on infomotions now, which is annoying. Here we go. I have a survivor be injured, hooked, or dying at the same time while using a perk. Thanatophobia. Okay. Thanatophobia. Thanatophobia. It's a fun word to say. Thanatophobia. 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 I don't know why that's so fun to say. Uh, I think it's a four scrolls icon. I think. I think, therefore, I am. That should be fun. Hey Frederick, how you doing? Hey, let's try this. Oh wait, I gotta change that off. Damn it. Uh, fuck, fuck. 1-800 fuck. Here we go. Doing pretty good, how are you? That's good to hear, and I'm well, thank you. What all is new with you?
seems like they fixed whatever issue was going on the last two days with Dead by Daylight. Which, funny enough, all happened after they pushed out a patch. For, uh... Oh, what is it? With, uh, Meet Your Maker. There was a network issue that whenever you try to queue up in the game as a killer, it would automatically disconnect you. And it would do it like three or four times in a row. Which was annoying. But it seems fixed now. Just disagree with her since she switched to a flashlight last second. There's another issue, but I don't want to say it because enough people are already abusing it as it is. Basically, if you use a certain offering as a killer and a survivor sees it, they will disconnect, which means that the killer cannot see anything in the game whatsoever. Which is annoying as hell. Oh, that's an issue. That explains why my frames aren't as high as they should be. Let's try this. There we go. I'm trying to figure out why when I toggled it, I was losing frames. Because I was on monitor display, not uh, game display. There we go. All is well. I thought something was off. I wish we good. I. That needs to go on this monitor. Because I used a little green dot from Discord. Let me know how the microphone is. It also helps me tell if the network's having issues or not, because I can just look at the voice connectivity and see what the bars are. <laughs> that is why I keep Discord up even though I'm in the call by myself. It's just a good way for me to see. Silly Rebecca. Look sure for survivors. Up you go. Went first. Hop off. Oh. Nope, gotcha. 
Let me go, bitch. Alright, anyone else want to come down? I mean, I've never heard of a basement trap or basement legion, but okay. Anyone ever heard of a basement legion? Anyone at all? Oh, nice. Well, not really nice because I guess it would have been neat if you were able to keep the money. But hey, man. Cool. Aversack just subscribed. Oh, slash. Oh, slash. Pretty accurate since we're playing a slasher. How you doing, Jelly? Thank you for your subscription. I hope uh, you and Miss Tippy are doing well. <laughs> and your Conan server? Huh? I already told you I agreed to the uh, thingy we talked about. Flash. You think you're getting into RPing? Do we need to alert you on? Bad RPing. I was waiting for Jelly to tell me that he's starting to RP as a uh, Uncle Ruckus. Turn the idea of turning your server into a little trading server. Nice. This was one of the weirdest games I think I ever played in my life. I hooked. I think it was Claire first. Then a Michaela. Then a Cheryl. And yeah, and ended up on Rebecca. But after I hooked one, the other came running in, and then the other came running in. I'm very confused of that. It was interesting. I mean, as you can see, I didn't get any penalties for babysitting the hook or anything. It just... Yeah. I have... Gives you things like gold and can add trade between players. That sounds pretty cool, man. All right, that was a very weird game. Hmm. 
All right, so let's go to the next one. Should be fine. Bum 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 bum. Skip cake, skip cake. Crisp leaf. Okay. Hmm. All right, so like I hope you enjoy your lurk. And as always, if you guys haven't done so, check out Silica. Definitely deserves the love. Boink. And I hope you had a good stream. I do. Hope you had a good stream. The rays are 11 and 0. That's just crazy to think. I like how the social media post board is a surprise shock face. But yeah. Interesting. One, two, three, four. That was a bad start. I followed the wrong person. There's one. There's two. Mm. 
Yeah. Might have to do some notes. Uh, also, the back of my head's a little weird. I don't know why. That was weird. Can't tell if like a spider fell from the roof on my head or something or not. Just feel like someone's crawling on the back of it. I don't know where the hell they are at. That's fine.
I don't think I'm able to find three of them, but I can't get the fourth. The fourth one's always hiding in a corner somewhere. Darn. If we didn't hook the other one, we would have got it. Darn. Oh well. Uh, Legion has one of four. They are four teenage friends. Two are boys, two are girls. You can sort of pick which one you want to be. And yeah, we are playing as the blue rabbit, which is one of the female ones. Oh yeah, there's two different girls, two different boys. The lore behind it is that there are four Canadian teenagers who committed a murder. And the entity took them to the realm because of the amount of hatred in the herds or something like that. So basically, edgy Canadian teenagers who killed a clerk or something. A little weird. So that's his first. So she was back here the whole time. Rip. Fine. We'll just screw up because she just wants to run the edges. We know we can go ahead and get the other guy, so we'll just go ahead and just tunnel him out. Makes no difference to me. Ah! 
Probably is decisive. Probably not. Probably does. Probably not. Just in case any of them have deliverance. Nice. GG's. GGGGs. Ah! That one's gonna be a fish. Came close, but yeah. Not what I meant to do. I meant to show name. Come on. I don't know why they put it right there when they could just put it over, off on the edge, like right here. But whatever. Yeah, what's he ever? What the hell's going on my hat? Oh, that's a loose string. That's what's pushing against my neck. Inside string on the hat is starting to come off. Grab a pair of scissors and trim that real quick. Wow, 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 wow. There you go. Yeah, that was weird. I kept wondering what the hell was brushing against the back of my head when the AC came on. And now just a bunch of white string. There you go. Random thinny cat hair. No Ed. Cross. That's probably my best bet in all honesty to get one off. This map is so tiny, I should be able to do it. That's fine.
Hmm. Like pop. We gotta get four people injured or dying. Pretty much not healthy. At the same time. Ooh, nice. Thought she was gonna be foolish to try to go for the pallet. Hiding around. Please don't bleed out. Really, there you go. Right oh, there she is. Maybe this wasn't a good map. It's two. Just need to figure out where the fuck Tap is. Nope, we can't get it. She died. Damn it, Tap, you only have one job. Tap had one job and he blew it. The only job was to go rescue her. Just like in the movies, Tap blew it. You coward, get back here.
Maybe Huntress would have probably been easier on this one now that I think about it. I mean, damn. That was sad. She's finding every pal on the map, and it's annoying. If she goes up there, I'm gonna bleed her. I'm not even fucking around. She's gonna go hide in the corner. I'm gonna make sure she bleeds out on top. Buy a lot of ticket with that look of finding every damn pallet on the map. And then we have Mr. Coward. Looks to hide in corners, not really do anything. Pallets, that's cool. There you go.
Fine. No, 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 no. Bad Michaela, no healing. He is, yeah. His only downfall is when he uses L2 ability, you can't hit the same survivor twice. Because if you do, you get broken out of his power. So ideally in a perfect world, you want to chain hit everyone. And then go for one of the people injured. And then hope that one of the other ones don't have a med kit. Because if they don't, then they instantly go down if they don't heal a bar. That's a good way to close the gaps real quick. It's just a good, nice value that if you're able to close gaps, you can. Um, you can also cancel out of it prematurely if you attack anything. So in this case, since I'm about to die, or about to fall out of it, just tap the wall real quick. Because I'm cool down. Which means I get it back a little bit faster to use. So I went for the deep wound on her on purpose because the idea was going to be that if I lost her, she would have to go heal. To where if I didn't go with the deep wound and I lost her, then I have no build up on her at all, which would have sucked. He fell for it. He thought I was going to duck around back right. And then he could drop the power and go over. Up you go.
Not bad, not bad, not bad. That can be fun. So second hit onwards, they drop their items. Alright, let's try this again. We'll get it, damn it. All we need is just four hits. An LED, that's a rarity. A Leon, a Kate, and an Ada. An Ada. Ah, da da. Ah, da da matada. Um. It is a M2. The default drive inside your PS5 is a M2 drive. And then you have another M2 slot inside your PS5 that if you lift the cover up, you'll notice a little teeny rectangle with one screw. You pop the screw, you can slip another M2 in there. Um, in order to put PS5 games on a drive, PS5 must be M2. PS4 could be SSD. And then movies and pictures could be a regular drive. So PS4 has to be SSD. And then PS5 has to be M2. Yeah, so like the Samsung series would be a good one. Um, I can tell you which one I have probably after stream. Um, is this it? Yeah, I think this is the one I have. I don't remember if it's a 970 or a 980. Um...
Which one do I have? 2022, I think it was? Or was it 2020? 2021? Ah, game started. Oh, wait. Where's... No. I don't think that's the one I bought. Fuck. Uh, after this one, I'll look. I have Amazon up. I just have two different M2s. I have to see which one it was. Because one of them I'll have to review. The other one I don't. One is from my computer. The other isn't from my computer. There we go. Challenge is on. Nice, nice, nice. This is actually sort of a mean build now that I think about it. Because we get the four slashes real quick. Everyone has the deep wound. They heal deep wound, they're broken. After they get the broken off, they have Sloppy Butcher still on them. Thank you, Bish. Oh, there she is. Smart. Big brains. Yeah, I wouldn't have time to get to it. Oh, 
It's a broken piece of metal that looks like a pipe, I guess. It looks like a busted open pipe. If I had to guess. Could be wrong. But that's what I'm guessing anyways. Pretty effective weapon. <laughs> Just a wee bit. I was honestly hoping she was gonna drop it sooner. That's fine. Hopefully next week we get the update. I imagine this would be even more of a pain in the ass to play against next week. Or the week after if we get the update. Since they can't self heal quickly. Can I get? Got it. Just in time. This is just a brutal build. And I can make it even worse too. If I were to get rid of uh, nowhere to hide and put on something else, like I don't know. Maybe a septic touch or something like that. Okay. Stab. Stab.
Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Where'd you go? Oh, there you are. Nice. Twelve up, twelve down. Yeah, so I got a Samsung 970 EVO Plus, and I bought the 2TB variation. So, this is what's in my PS5 at the moment, as an external drive. Well, not external, but secondary drive. And then outside that, I do have a secondary drive that is only for PS4 games. Which is also a Samsung. You should like to see a pattern here. I just really like Samsung drives. That's it. Lou. Hello. And then this is my external. So this one's my external drive for PS4 games. The two terabyte version. So I have a total three terabytes of PS5 storage, two terabyte of PS4 storage. And yeah. And then for that one, it's so tiny. I don't know if I can show it well or not. Yeah, I'll probably show it. This little teeny tiny blue thing right here. 
The one that my hand is moving? This is the PS4 drive. Not super tiny. You know, teeny tiny. It's about the size of a credit card. So I just take that. I have it plugged into the back USB port. And then I just have it resting underneath the console like that. So you don't even see it. So anything that is PS4, I have on that one. Unless I'm actively going to play it. So like, let's say I'm doing Challenge Runs. So if I'm going to do like a Dark Souls 3, since Dark Souls 3 is only on PS4, then I'll have it on my internal M2 drive. That way I get the benefit of faster read write speeds. But when I'm not playing it, I have it sitting on my uh, external drive. That way I have more room to move stuff. And you could do the same thing with PS5 games. You could move PS5 games to your external drive. But you cannot play them off your external. So let's say you had uh, Cyberpunk. PS5 Cyberpunk. And you were done playing it. But you didn't want to delete it because, you know, whatever. It could be you don't want to eat up your bandwidth or you just don't want to delete it. You'll get back to it later. You could take that and move it to your external drive. And then when you want to play it again, you just move it back to your internal drive. Which can be beneficial. It's a good way of doing it. You don't tie up your network by having to re-download and do all that stuff. But, yeah. Hmm. Uh, damage generator, destroy a drive pallet ten times. We pretty much do it so enough as it is, so that's fine. I'm really enjoying playing Legion tonight. I don't know why. Legion just seems like so much fun tonight. And this one's sort of a nasty perk. Especially tied with that. Hmm. Let's play a different killer. Let's spread the love around a bit. Wow, wow, wow. We didn't miss this. Or we could do Wesker. Let's try Wesker. Let's try Wesker for a little bit. It's been a while. Seven minutes is all he could spare after all. Busy man. Yeah. Busy man. Seven minutes is all he could spare. Load out. What do we got? Standard visible visibility stuff. Okay. What are we Should we get on that? I was curious about this one though. What is this one exactly? Yeah, I don't think it's gonna be handy whatsoever. For what we were doing. I was trying to see if there was anything we could have done on Legion build to be a little nastier, but that works. Reveal aura. Of course. Of course. Then when they be there, we see them for four seconds, plus two seconds. We see them for eight seconds, plus two seconds, ten seconds. All 
Alright, cool. Did lose some frames, it sounds a little concerning. Not a lot though. We do have an auto. So we do have one stars member we could kill. We do have a David, a Meg, and a Michaela. Nice. Me ice. Hmm. The auto not bringing anything is a little sauce. The med kits, I'm not too shocked. That's sort of standard. Hmm. Big thunks. Thump thump. Thump thump. Thump thump. Thump thump. Thump thump thump. Bum bum bum. Uh, why Ormond? Why? Seven minutes is all I can spare for you, Makila. Seven minutes. Seven. Not six. Not eight. Seven. You disappoint me. Is that the best you've got? Seven minutes is all I can spare to play with you.
Are you trying to make me angry? merely postponing the inevitable. Alright. Might as well get these challenges out of my way. Ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Just getting started. Too bad you won't make it much further. A little bit unfortunate we got this map, to be honest. Poor performance indeed. I'll see you dead.
You can't hide forever! Alright, anyone else? Somehow I was hoping for auto. I don't know why, but I was. Ah, my leg. Spasmed. Leg spasm. Greeted. They literally had the game, but they greeted. If they would have just went for the last gen and not tried to save the one person, they probably all three would have walked out. So they literally threw the game away to us. Which I appreciate, but still. So we went from TTV to put in kick.com as our name. Okay. I would have figured, you know, name dash kick or kick dash something, but okay. That's fine. That's cool. I mean, at least I didn't put HTTPS in there, I guess. But yeah. Eight times by any means, eight gold. It's pretty much the only path we could take to finish that off. No crunch, but it's fine. Right, fine. Alright, so we could be a little bit more free on what we do.
Eh. Might be better. Put pressure on him. Try that. That's yeah, fine. I go for that. I map. shall release Uruburos. 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 Only two of them, though. Three of them. I have no clue where the fourth one is. This is not going to end well. What? Just going to go buy a lot of ticket. I'll see you dead.
Too bad you won't make it much further. Alright, let's go on that way. You disappoint me. Is that the best you've got? <laughs> hey, Mango, what's up? Thank you, thank you. Hope you and Mr. Penguins are doing well. Up you go. Super honest. 
<laughs> Are you trying to make me angry? I'm just gonna milk her for a little bit because I think all she's doing is spamming pallets and going on the same loop. So get her to spam all these annoying little pallets out of the way. He's already got one down and a bunch of them are almost gone. Like that. He's gonna do this loop now. That's all she knows how to do. There's one or two loops and that's it. Not that shocking. entire time she did absolutely nothing to help her team she wasn't working on Jones nothing so you can be the best looper in the game as a survivor but if you're asking on that generator you're not doing anything to help your team collision error wasn't even on the porch and yet I got clipped sounds like garden of joy The sad part about this is that she's gonna get out and she did literally no gems or anything. That's the only sad part. But if we sat there and just try to chase her, we would have got nothing done. So, it is what it is. Nothing on the side. He's up top. The 
You're merely postponing the inevitable. I got stuck on a bush. That's fine. So we know that's empty. There. Now she's fucked. She has to take an exit gate. That little wall wasn't there, I could make this a lot easier. <laughs> but not having to constantly go that one way. Ah, fuck that up. That's fine. GG's. Yeah, she was just jumped by this one waiting. Yeah. <laughs> GG's. She's very good at looping. I won't say that much. Banana bunny. Interesting. Interesting. We have time for maybe one more game. So how do we want to do this one? Next one. Let's go with Big Thonks. Who do we want to play with? to play as. We could do one more Wesker game, because why the fuck not, but... We also have Nemesis. We also haven't done a Skull Merchant game tonight, so let's do a Skull Merchant one. Yeah. 
Yeah, let's try this. Wait, I got the aura thingy, don't I? Bam bam, bam bam, bam bam, bam bam. Oh no, that offering you made rejected. No auto haven. No no, no auto haven. No auto haven for you. No no. No 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 no. No, 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 no. I've got a lot of work I need to do on this one server. How I look at it. i got to move a fuck ton of stuff over. Oof. No! Uh, the one time it bites me in the ass. I should have waited. I should have used the other one. I shouldn't have done that. I'm stuck with this map now. Uh, I hate this map. I've already probably seen they're lulling their brains out. the fuck out of that. Alright, so whoever is doing the sabotaging, I need a face camp out of the game. Because that's three hooks now they've dropped within like the first minute of the game. But they really need to go chill the fuck out somewhere. Alright, so to Claudette, we need to face camp out of the game. But she's just being toxic little cunts.
Stop both these hooks, bitch. No! Oh, I got greedy. I should have went right, not left. I could have gone if I went right. Yeah. Fuck me. Hit me right in the fucking ass. Yeah. I think I do. I don't know if I get that clawed out, I'm face camping out of the game. I don't want to go here. They get fucked with a no hook upstairs.
Yeah, it's fine. Stairs. There's one upstairs, I see you. I'm gonna shake her off that one. So no, she no longer has deliverance. That's confirmed. She was burnt for last use of that. Strike, maybe? No? It was around here originally. There's a radar thing you kicked on.
Yeah. Just waiting to see which drone gets taken down first. <coughs> Not hopping off that one. GG's. Yeah. That was just a uh, box. Only five percent. Yeah. Not bad for the R3. But I wasn't going to sit there all night and play a game of Find a Hook. What a clue that takes everything down. It's not fun. Then two more off that end. All right. Alright, so we are going to wrap it up there for tonight. So thank you friends so much for hanging out. I hope you all have a good night's rest. Great day tomorrow. Thank you guys for everything. Um, my head sort of hurts. Um, I don't know if I want to raid or not. Probably not. Yeah, I'll probably just wrap it up here for tonight. So... Thank you guys for everything. We'll raid probably Thursday. There is no stream tomorrow because tomorrow is Wednesday and I don't stream on Wednesdays. The next stream will be Thursday. 
So yeah, have a good one, guys. Love you all. Bye. And I hope you enjoy your PS5 uh, Suicide Run. I hope you have a lot of fun with it. Take care, guys.